Hello everyone, Sargon Destroyer of Worlds here, and welcome back to another episode of Timberborn. Yes, we are back with our favorite beavers here in Beaver Town, and we've got a number of them hard at work today, and you can see this is going to be our primary objective for today. But you also might notice how, um, yeah, things aren't exactly lined up. So what we're going to do is we are going to come in, uh, we'll leave the ones that they're currently working on, but otherwise we're just going to delete these. In fact, we're going to delete this guy as well. But we have plenty more explosives to plant uh, in this episode. We'll actually get rid of this. And I think what we're going to also have to do if we come in. Yeah, they can't reach them, but our beavers are ingenious and they will follow a path if needed. So there we go. They can now make their way to get all these. And I think we'll eventually, yeah, we are likely to eventually need to put at least one staircase coming down so that they can reach uh, this, this one explosives because they can reach one up, but yeah, they, they can't get there. So let's do that as well. Let's plant a single explosive there. Now, while we're over here, uh, our gravity batteries have been put on pause. Uh, well, and you notice, I should point out, we are at the beginning of a drought. Uh, seven days, we should be fine. Everything's fine. Um, yes, uh, we've never had problems with droughts in this uh, this colony. No, I didn't nearly kill them last episode. Nope, nope. That is false news. So we do need a gears, and we definitely have a gear shortage. Uh, but if we come here, there's actually 1,200 gears throughout the colony. And I think most are, you can see, yeah, a good, at least half of them are sitting in Beaver Town proper, which makes sense. That is our hub of industrial activity. But if we look, we have been playing uh, whack-a-mole with our distribution routes, and we could probably continue doing that as well. But I think we're probably better off uh, putting in another route, uh, another route, another distribution post. So if we come under, where are you, sir? Labor, uh, distribution post. Let's see if we can find, ooh, a spot. And this spot might work here. Now, the only problem is if we do put one out here, we're basically without Putting pathing all the way around, they won't be able to reach all this space. So I'm not a fan of that. Hmm. So where, oh where? You know, I wonder, maybe what we should do. Yeah, here's what we're going to do. We're going to come here and, oh, by the way, I meant to connect that path, which should make, yeah. That should now become reachable. But I think the other thing we're going to do is we are going to come in. And we are going to place, I think, our distribution post right here. Now, let's see. Okay, so we did a little more space. So we do need to put fill in this back area. And one here. We can get rid of this. And that should fit now. Or not. Okay. Uh, need to fill in a little more. Okay. I think we got it. I think we got this, this, this. And now. Nut. Blasphemy. What is wrong with you, sir? Ah, okay. Oop. You know, one more platform. And now we should be able to come back into our labor and put a distribution post. There we go. All good. That was no trouble at all. So hopefully we can get that up and running uh, very soon. So that will, I think will help a number of problems we've been having uh, because Beaver Town proper is the main area. 
uh, of our industrial hub. So having more ability is long overdue. Ooh, what happened here? Why are you flooding? Okay, let's raise you up. So that is not good. We got some poor hungry beavers. So maybe actually one of the other things we should do is let's have a look. So I think Metallica can stop sending uh, wood. That's fine. Beaver Town is sending, I think that's paper. I do wish uh, we could click on this and see what that is. Uh, they are sending carrots, so we're fine. Okay, I think we're, we're fine for now. Hopefully uh, Hilltop here survives. Uh, these guys are a glutton for punishment and they seem to do uh, quite well, uh, especially when we uh, constantly flood them. So, okay, let's uh, let's speed things up and kind of move away from that because uh, that is just a big downer. Now, I think the other thing we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here and we have tons and tons of planks. So if we come into our wood, Gear shops, as a reminder, takes planks and turns them into gears. So let's find a way to get more in here. So we're gonna remove that farmhouse, come into our structures. Actually, sorry, uh, we want storage, which we'll slow things down just a tad. So we're gonna put storage, space. Yes, and we can fit another storage unit there. Now we'll come into our platforms. We'll put those in and we will put workshop, workshop, come back to our food, put a farmhouse. And now we'll come in with platforms all the way across. We'll put a singular staircase for the moment. We will come in, uh, let's do this little trick. We will lower the levels so we can easily see them. There we go. Nice access in. And we're going to make this one for gears. And we'll also make this one for gears. This one will just turn off for now. Hit the return symbol back to the top. Oh, two stranded beavers. Ah, oh, come on, man. Okay, so we are going to have to come and we're going to, I think we're going to have to micromanage this. So let's do that. We'll get rid of that pathing. Get rid of this. Delete. Okay, we need an emergency explosives. We will pause the completion of this staircase. And we will mark this a super high priority. And we'll let it run, let it rip. While that's all being set up, we'll quickly come back here. Because we're gonna need power. Now to get power, I think what we're gonna have to do Actually, we'll pause things for a moment. We're gonna need a rectangular or a rectangular intersection here, but that has to be lower. Hmm. How do we get the turn? Okay, actually here, here's how we're gonna do things. We're gonna put a platform here, come with a intersection, high plank shaft, uh, and then what we are going to do is we are going to put explosives here and here. And then we'll have a high power shaft coming down and then intersection. And that will be well connected. And speaking of connection, let's make sure these get connected. And there we go. Okay. So we're going to get things running again. Oh, let's get rid of this. And oops, overshot it. Come on, dude, dude, go, go, go. Yes, come on, faster, faster, faster. Do it, do it, do it. Perfect, done. You're free. Get back. 
So we are going to now have to just, I think, micromanage this for a bit. Okay, we are going to have to remove this almost completed staircase. That should now be reachable. There we go. And hopefully he makes it back. Otherwise, we're going to have a drowned uh, golem, which would be very, very sad. Now, I think the other thing... Okay, so let's double check. We have all this underway. Beaver is injured. Golem is out of fuel. Yeah, that was me today uh, at the day job. Um, I was out of fuel as well. Okay, so we'll come back to that, but I do want to get back to our water wheel project. Even though the causeway today is going to be the big thing. We are going to make sure we have uh, the ability to get down here. Now, I do think we have a bit of a mistake. But we will detonate these. We'll set these off. And the reason why I say that is yes. So if we look here, if I go to place a water wheel. And let's pause that for a second because I don't actually want that built. This is in the wrong spot. So we need to get rid of this. Then I think all we need to do is come in with a levee and then a power intersection. Intersection, there we go. And that's connected. Okay, so we can let things fly again. Uh, we can actually as well remove this and we can get explosives here. Sweet! Sweet! Oh, uh, this is going to be something. OK, this is too far. And I think that is as a result. Oh, huh. no, not what I thought it was. Hmm. We're going to have to figure out why or oh why or how to get him there. Hmm. Maybe if we remove you. There we go. That's fine. So the other thing we can do uh, while we're over here, get rid of this path now, and we can come in with a high powered shaft. This we can come and get rid of this as well. We can do high powered shaft, and then we can get this connected all the way over here. Oh, we might as well, he's got that under control. Put that in, there we go. Okay, so now let's get over to the fun part. And that is this area over here. So let's detonate all this. We will come in now with a staircase so they can come on down. And we can get some more explosives. That would be fine. They'll be able to get to this one as soon as that is built. Funny how these got filled in, but okay, it is what it is. Uh, all reachable now, that is good. So we can also come in and detonate. Hmm, do we want to detonate these? So if we detonate these, we can lay explosives. Uh, but this doesn't really help. Yeah, so we can. Let's detonate these. We'll come in, get those explosives laid. We can come in and detonate these two and put explosives down. Are these reachable? Yes, everybody's reachable. Okay, so speaking of reachable, this, well, it's getting there. A little more work to do. Did I not place, uh, hang on. I thought I did. Come, yeah, it's there. Um, so we'll soon have that being built, which is gonna be a big, big help. Let's just have a look. We got a few things going on here. Lacks power. Ah, okay, perfect reminder. So we can come here now, blow those two up, and we can do a high power shaft as we planned. And then a power intersection. 
That should grant these both power. Building needs power to operate. No workers available in the district. Well, that's a lie. That's a lie. So I think, though, we can come over here. We could probably turn off these for now to allocate those workers. Same thing for this. We'll prioritize those. Actually, then we can turn this back on. Make that a normal priority. Let's make that a normal priority and unpause it. So that should be fine. That should work out. Same thing here. Let's pause it and release the worker. So as they become available, that will be a good, good help. So yes, we're now starting to produce gears, which is good. But that's only part of our solution. So now that we're producing them, let's come to our distribution post. Set up a nice route. Oh, it's the last one we have available. We're going to have to have a look-see at all these. And we are going to send uh, gears over here as well. So we can start getting these built. Once that's built, we can start getting the rest of those built. It's going to be very nice. It's going to be very, very swish. Ooh, this is going to be fun. Um, nighttime explosions. So wheat. Okay, now we do have a bit of a problem. We need to get up. But I think what we're going to do is we're just going to build a staircase here. And... Actually, hang on. Pause. I don't think... Okay, I don't think we need that, actually. But let's come into our explosives. And the reason why I say that is they're supposed to be able to reach up one. Okay, but they... Yeah, they can reach down from here. They can drop, drop. It's only in the middle... But yeah, I don't think we'll need them because we should be able to explode all these around and then they'll be able to reach the ones that are hidden in the middle. Uh, yeah, so that's fine. That'll work out. Uh, let's make sure. No, we haven't. Oh, our food situation here is pretty horrendous still. I caramba. Um, not sure why that is a problem. So these guys are prioritized from planting. Let's get them to prioritize harvesting. And we'll just get them to start harvesting food galore. Same thing here. Please harvest. Do nothing but harvest, because we do not want Hilltop to die out. That would be terrible. But you know, one other thing we could do... Hmm. Why don't we look to squeeze in a, an above the water? Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to come in here. And I believe it's a three by two. And now we can come in and place a farmhouse. That should end up helping a, a lot. Oh, hang on. Let's stop that. And the reason why is our staircase is all the way over there. So let's come a tad closer. And we'll do our three by two here. And that should help. Yeah, see much, much better range. And in fact, now we can also come in and plant some other crops, like some more cattails. Let's just do that. Make everybody happy. Unless you're a cat with a tail that we're after. Okay, that was a bad, bad dad joke. Um, sorry about that one. That one was pretty sad. Uh, speaking of sad, very sad. This is all flooded. It's going to die within days. I'm sorry, my dudes. But let's let's give you guys something to improve your your well-being. Um, uh, let's do a monument. Flame of Progress. Should be able to reach that. It's always a plan. We put in these two planter pots and then promptly forgot about it all. So 
Yeah, that that will make everything right as I starve you guys to death. Ooh, oh, 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 that's bad. So let's lower this, put all that water through. I did not notice that. Okay, you know what? It's time to get dangerous. Okay, no, not dangerous. But what we're going to do, it'll slow things down here momentarily. What I want to do is connect now a path through here. We're going to need a staircase down. And we're going to come in and then remove a row of trees. And that's because we're going to move this power line and get rid of all of this and have the power line run behind the floodgates. So if we come around, this will pop out here. So what we need to do is put a power shaft, one here. That should work out quite well. Now we can come down. Why don't we also, because I think, I remember looking at this before, uh, if we look at Metallica, we do have some vacancies. So why don't we take the opportunity to put a little bit more of housing in here? So we can put that there, and then we will put a single mini lodge, the correct direction, please. And we'll just put in some pathing. And now we will also replace this and then put an intersection shaft right there. We'll mark this as a super high priority. So once these trees are removed, we can now come through. I think this will work out quite well. So also at the same time, why don't we come in with our decorations and then put a roof on here. There we go. Isn't that cute? Nice and cute. I like it. The beaver should like it. You know, we got a nice little statue overlooking this area. So cute. Uh, why don't we also put a, another statue here, help folks out, make them a little happy. Okay, that's going well. Speaking of well, let's see how our water wheels are going. Detonate this. We can now unpause this. We can add one more water wheel. And I think I do want to come in here and remove all of this as well. Let's make sure they actually prioritize this one. And then they should hopefully, we'll have to remove the staircase and all this. And that should begin to work out. Okay. Now, while we're over here, let's come in and remove this pathing. Yeah, they can reach it. Perfect. That in and super high priority. Super low priority, very low priority. Hopefully that works out. We've got one day left until the uh, drought is over, which is fine. We seem to, ooh, wait a minute, pause. Metallica, what do you mean you don't, oh my goodness, what's going on? Please harvest food. Oh my goodness. You have no food? Dudes. Okay, uh, are we distributing food out of here? Yeah, okay, so stop distributing carrots. Okay, that's fine. Uh, that is not good, that's shocking. That's a high priority. They should be able to reach all that, that is fine. Looks like we might have lost access to this area. 
why don't we see if we can regain that by coming around. And we will remove a single resource here. Too far. Ooh. How far can you get? Maybe here? Okay, let's remove this one instead. Cancel this. Okay, we got cocky by doing a bit of work over here and not being prepared for it. Okay, let's speed things along. Okay, they're starting to grab foods. Okay, so we're fine. Let's do a quick look. Hilltop, yeah, we know you're starving to death, but you got some food. District 5 is fine. Golem District is fine. District 7's got plenty of food and no real beavers. That's fine. Uh, Overlook, there are no real beavers here. Beaver Town is fine. And we're back to Metallica. Okay. So we're doing okay. We've got this being built. Which I can't wait for. This is going to be great. Once we get all the water replenished throughout the system... This is almost connected. As we come in here, we can now mark this as the high priority. And we should be close to be, well, I was about to say close to being connected. No, that's a lie. That's a lie. Sorry, I lied. So we are going to come in. Need to put these in. Should be able to get away with uh, removing all the pathing, hopefully. Uh, while we're here, we can come in and intersection. Put that one in. Intersection. Yeah, and we should be able to get another intersection in. That should work out. Just need them to get these explosives. Let's get those put in so we can get rid of the staircase that we have right here. And then this. Go, go, go! And the drought is over. We have survived. Actually, I've not looked at this. Okay, uh, no starvation deaths in the recent uh, deaths, so I'll take that as a win. Um, okay, so water's gonna come flooding through. We are gonna need to get water back in through the system. Let's see, yeah, okay, we can fill this area up. Lost a little bit of water, but not much. Just play with the levels. Almost. Not that I would flood these folks. I would never, never, I tell you. Okay, I think that should be good. We can see water flowing back through the system. I love it. Looking good. We'll come in through here. Ooh, I didn't notice this, but these guys aren't grabbing any water. Thank goodness. It looks like we've got the right balance of large water tanks, so that's good news. Now, the other thing we can do while is try to get the water out of here. So that will help. These guys will die within three days, so we might be fine. We will see. Let's see if we can convince these guys to prioritize some work over here. Come on. There we go. High priority. Go, go, go. Although, I can understand why they're not too keen about these commands, because kind of starving them to death, and it's, it's a tad rude. Um... Prioritize folks working here, working there. 
let's also prioritize. We already haven't. Yeah, that is prioritized by the haulers. So will these guys. So that should be a big help. Oh. I, oh, sorry, my dude. Um, okay, that wasn't cool. So let's slow things down as we consider what we've done to our poor beavers. And that has starved them to death. Okay, um, my bad, so sorry. I thought we'd make it. I thought we would make it, honestly. Okay. Um, we'll probably come over here now and send some food over as well. Let's just send some more carrots. That should help. Ooh, this is good news, though. Let's let's think of the positives, right? The positives. Uh, we can start getting this built. It just needs logs. It can prioritize this. And then they can come back and finish this guy off. It's fine. It's all good, right? It's... If you kind of just don't look at things in a way, it makes things a lot better. So we can get rid of this staircase. Uh, come in and do an explosives. Come back in and do power. Power, that will be fine. The building needing water. Yeah, I had a funny feeling it was this Lido. Let's come in and we will quickly replenish Metallica. It's all going, it's all going well. Well, 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 well. Okay, let's not walk too far away because unlike the dams where I have it just flood over the dams, I am pouring the water in. So some more hunger death. Uh, I feel real bad. I feel extremely bad. Okay, that's gonna take a moment to fill up. Wow, we really lost a lot of water there. And then same thing here. They're not, okay, come on guys. I get it, you're upset. I'm kinda starving you, but please work. I, I, you know, I get it at times. Okay, we should make sure that is on planting. We're fine here. Wow, look at all that water. Water, water, water. So I think we can turn... Oop. Come on. There we go. I'm like having some problems. Woo! A little bit of flooding, not much. That will go away relatively quickly. But the Lido's are working and the beavers are happy once again. So that's fine. So now this area, it's doing well. Okay, well, let's, let's kind of just go away from the starving beavers because they're, they're a buzzkill, honestly. So if we come here, we can detonate all of these. And now the beavers, uh, the golems will be able to reach around. We can start planting uh, the next layer of explosives that we'll need. Get all that done. Come in here, we can detonate these two. Now the bummer is at some point, we are going to have to dismantle all of this. But it'll be fine. I just don't want to do it quite yet. Okay, speaking of good news here, though, look at this. We can just unpause all of these. And then all we'll have to do after is put a power intersection as soon as this is done. Uh, and it's done. Awesome. So now these can just be built uh, at will, and it's going to go fine. It's fine. 
Wowzers, but look at all these explosives. Absolutely loving this. Once we can blow all these up, it's going to be a beautiful, beautiful day. Okay, so whoops. What else do we need? Oop, oop, key smashing. Uh, what else do we need to accomplish here quickly as we look to wrap things up? Oh, this is done. So why don't we add a new route? We're gonna send more gears over. And then I think the other thing is we will add a route. We'll come up here. We're gonna add more carrots. We're gonna add bread. We're gonna add, let's say grilled potatoes, grilled potatoes, grilled chestnuts. Probably should have done that first before sending gears over. <laughs> yeah, that might've been kinder of me, but uh, yeah, we just can't, like, something really bad happened, uh, and I'm not exactly sure what. I think as well, though, we can let this out, the excess water. We can lower this as this begins to fill up. I think we can lower this to let the water through faster. We can come over here, detonate this. Get that rocking and rolling. Let's uh, get that going. Got a few things to add in. Then that will all be connected, right? That'll be nice. Oh, no, I lied. Be like, and everything is not fine. Okay, we can do that. Then we can build a platform. And then on top, we can put a just a regular old power shaft. That should work out. So let's prioritize all of this work. Although I don't think they've got too, too much else to do in this district at this point. Could be wrong, but I think that's uh, that should keep them all busy. You know what we can do too, is we're eating through the, the ruins, which is great. Why don't we take the opportunity to plant some uh, chestnut trees? I don't think we have any in the vicinity. So let's do that. I think that would make everybody happy to have a few chestnut trees. Oh, one thing we didn't get back to, and this will be the long, slow, arduous task, which we will not be completing uh, this episode is getting that wall built. But what we can do is why don't we come along and figure out maybe along here. Maybe we'll leave an opening. There we go. Slowly coming along. And we'll have to keep that path running uh, for a little bit. Eventually we'll be able to get up and they'll come around and complete all this from on high. But for now we can also do this. And we can run a pathing along here. I don't think we'll need to go any higher. Oh, um, we'll do this for now and then we'll come back and put in floodgates. Got to remember to do the whole floodgate system because uh, we still want the water to come down here. 
But we could always change our mind. I don't know if we truly need this large reservoir, but it's something we can look at for sure. Okay, so this is almost completely turning. We just need this guy. Market high priority. We will then generate some power by finding that sweet spot of letting some water in. So I think we'll do one height, there we go. And just look at this, okay, let's slow it to normal speed, but look at the power. We are just pumping it all the way through. And of course it looks really great when you go high speed. And it's making a mockery of me at this point. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, it's going, it's a rocking and a rolling. So if we come on down. I'm just having a hard time. Oh, you know what we need to do is yeah, need to raise Like, why isn't this not filling up? I can tell you why, because I left those floodgates all the way open. So that means we are now close to being able to do everything we need over here. Which is connecting up the power. It's connected, connected. As you can see, it's turning. Come in here. We'll leave one space for now. Wowzers. Okay, this has been a bit of a pan. Well, actually, last episode was a complete panic. This is getting us back to where we should have been. Oh, but these poor beavers in Hilltop. We just can't... I oh, mean, we'll prioritize this building by haulers as well. Probably reduce these guys here. We have 12 job vacancies. Maybe we'll pause one of these. Hmm. No longer have chestnuts. This is very sad. Okay, let's turn off the builders' huts. Hmm. Okay, lumberjack gatherers' flag. Yeah, there's chestnuts. They just need to. Do the whole gather the chestnuts thing. They, they should just do this. So let's prioritize that. Hopefully get some chestnuts in. But it's probably they're coming in and they're going out as fast as they, they can come in. So I'm very sad. I feel very bad for these beavers. Kind of... Okay, they've not been dying off or otherwise the death reports have kind of just come and gone, which, ooh, okay. But let's let's do a few things here. We're gonna come in, oh, and we might be running low on explosives at this point. They're having a hard time keeping up, which is unfortunate, but okay. Let's have a little look-see over here. Uh, let's turn on this uh, paper mill. Let's prioritize it. Let's turn on this explosives factory. Prioritize them. We can probably turn off another gear workshop. So we have these two running. So let's turn off. Probably turn off a few of these things. Let's turn off these wood workshops. So that everything is that is needed is going to the printing press. Oops. Oh, no, that's a wood workshop. We don't need that. Um, ah, and to be looking here. Okay. We're good. That should be fine, right? And we're going to convert paper into explosives, logs into paper. Okay. We're fine. It's all fine.
So this is good news up here, though. You can kind of see all this churning and burning. Um, the gears are coming. We've got plenty of gears. Uh, yeah, this is this is just going to be a bit of a grind. Well, you know what I could do? Here's what we're going to do. We are going to put a staircase to come up. Put it here. Put a path in. Put a path in. And then we can run pathing. So we are going to get rid of this block. Get rid of all this. We will put in... Oh, where are we? Where are we? This block. And then we'll put a path on top. Let's prioritize it. So then what we can do while we look to shut things down very soon here... Get this built. Yeah, this guy's coming up, and then we can put all the other blocks here. I uh, should have done the center. And then I can run the path all the way up top, and they'll just build their way across, and I won't have to micromanage it, which is very, very painful. And while they're thinking about all that work, let's give them more work. You know what? Let's not give them more work. Okay, actually, we can give them a better pathing, and then we can give them more work. Let's do that. We'll come in, get rid of this, and then we'll come back into our landscaping. And put our train blocks. And then we can put a small path up there. That is good. That is fine. That works. You know what also would work? I've been very generous with my beavers. Holy, I've been a generous overlord. Only working 15 or 10 hour days. You know, maybe this is why poor Hilltop's been starving. Because uh, the beavers are like, no, we'd rather chill. Okay, the good news is we are now back in positive territory. So let's make sure things are set to planting. There we go, that should be fine. And we'll have to solve our chestnut problem in the future. Ooh, okay. It's always one more thing. I'm like good old Columbo for those that are of that vintage. Um, just one more thing before I go. Let's get this water topped off up in Hilltop. Because we also don't want to now make them die of thirst. That would be very, very cruel while all this is going on. We can also give them another job here. Let's prioritize this one, come in, prioritize that. In fact, we're going to make you work 24 hours there for a moment. Go, 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 go. Get that done. I want that done. And we can let the water continue to fill up here. We're fine. That is good. And as day breaks, we can reduce that to a reasonable 15 hour day. But let's let's take at least one fruit of our labor here as we slow things down. We can now come in here and we can get rid of all of this. All of that. Leave that staircase, get rid of this. In fact, let's come in for now and also get rid of... Hmm. Actually, we'll leave that there temporarily because I have plans. And I don't want to do that this episode, but my goodness, just look how much more open this looks without the, uh, the electrical grid running through. You can actually now see the water flowing through. That is great news. That's in the wrong position. We can fix that up a bit. Everybody's happy. Except the guys wanting to deliver the explosives because we don't have enough. So this massive causeway project, although improved, we still have a lot of work to do. 
and we might even need to look to improve our explosives making capability. So with that, uh, we will leave things here for today. I'd like to thank you for watching, and until next time, bye for now.